Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to my channel, Foundry RC, the best place to beat your need for everything RC. Real quick, I just want to share something else I got with you guys, not related to RC, but if anybody out there is into EDC, you may have heard of this brand, Notorious EDC. I happened to finally get lucky enough and score one of their Big Papas and Titanium Stolon. So I just wanted to open up real quick and show you guys Notorious sticker, Big Papa sticker and the Big Papa itself. So this is actually a flathead screwdriver bottle opener. On the back here we got a pry and you can use these edges right here as like an unboxer because they're really sharp edges. So I figured maybe I'll try cutting open this box with this right here. It's also, you know, could be a knock now you want to use it. That could do some damage. So uh, it's got a hole for a lanyard. I think they're pretty cool. If you're into EDC, you might know what this is. You might be interested. I just thought I'd share. Back to the RC video. Let's unbox this. All right guys, so I have a new product for the Primal Muscle Truck to show you guys today. It comes from Benjamin DeLeon in the Primal RC Muscle Truck Enthusiast Facebook group. I'm gonna open it up and show you guys what he created for us and uh, we'll go from there. I'll get this box open for you guys real quick. All right, let's see what's inside. All right, so what we have is a pair of transport wheels that he has uh, 3D printed. Let me pull these completely out of the box. So what Benjamin has made for us is transportation wheels for the Primal Monster Truck. It's a three-part wheel made of PLA for the wheel and TPU for the tire. So the tire actually has like a rubber-like feel and it has like a give. I don't know if he has a foam inside here or if it's just the PLA. They are, it's like a tire, but it's got some feedback to it. like. Like I said, like there's a home or something in there. The wheel consists of three parts. You got the hub, the wheel, and then he made us planetary drive mental to the truck. Let me get these mounted up and show you what they look like on the truck. These are not for bashing. They are for transportation and working on the truck use only. You can run on them. If you look at uh, the Facebook groups, you'll see Chris gave it a little quick test just to show that you know you can drive the truck if you need to on it, but that's not the purpose of these. These are for transportation. They are very scaled like the real monster truck. I'm gonna show you some size comparisons so you get an idea of how big these are and uh, how small they are compared to the stock tires. These are very cool thank you Benjamin for coming up with these and if anybody else is looking to get a pair please go check out the Facebook group right now it's Primal RC Monster Truck Enthusiast and you can find them from Benjamin De Leon. all right so first off side by side with the stock Primal Monster Truck tire as you can see it is definitely smaller it is definitely thinner but this is what you want you don't want this big Monster Truck tire on it when you're trying to transport or work on it and the height of this is still perfect but it's going to keep the axle off which I'll show you when it's on the truck. Here it is next to a stock X-Max tire. It's a touch taller than the X-Max tire. You can see right there, it's just a touch taller. Definitely still thinner than the X-Max tire. So this is a Proline Badlands X-Max tire. This is uh, a touch taller than it and a little bit thinner. So give you an idea of how big it is. So this is how you're gonna be securing the wheel onto the truck with this uh, 3D printed planetary drive. Goes right on here. All right, let me go stick them on the truck and show you what it looks like. So I'm going to show you how easy it is to install these wheels on the truck. Take the wheel with the hex side. Take the planetary gear and just give it a little twist. Make sure it's nice and tight. And that's it. They're installed. And you can see we're getting about three inches clearance. Just shy of three over there about three inches all around. This is with my setup. Um, the way I have my shock set up, if you notice my arms are pretty much level and the shocks are a little bit more than 50% compressed there. <clears throat> if you lift them up, let them fall, about 50% compressed. Let's see the rear shocks. Yeah, that's about how my shocks sit. So it's nice and level and I get about three inches clearance there. Get three inches here. The pumpkins, it looks like you get about two, two and a half. With my current setup, which I have the extended arms on, from center to center, I'm at 29 inches. And in between the wheels, we get 21 inches. And I'm at 24 inches wide in the front. As you can see, the wheel is able to hold up the weight of the truck. It's not really compressing at all. And there is give if you need it. All right, to give you some measurements on the wheels, they come in at eight inches tall. The tires are two inches. And if you go by the little planetary that sticks out, it's actually two and a half inches. 
All right, that's about it for this video. If you guys are interested in those wheels, please go ahead and reach out to Benjamin De Leon in the uh, Primal RC Monster Truck Enthusiast Facebook group. And if uh, you're not on Facebook and you want to get these wheels, leave a comment in the video down below and I'll see if I can get you in touch with him. All right, thanks for checking out the video. See you in the next one. I'm